Today I'm going to be body painting one of my very own creations, Astrogal. So the first thing I'm doing is painting the base coat in silver. As amazing as a model as she is, she has some challenges, like all the tattoos. And so this paint that I'm using, this silver Maron powder paint, is very good for covering up things opaquely. And she has this little ankle bracelet that can't come off, so I have to work around it. And of course, just the other day, she cut her knee open, so she has a big scab. So I took one of my pasties that are used for nipples and I put it over her kneecap so I don't have to paint on the bruise. In this next step, I'm applying a base coat for the universe on her chest. I don't want to overlay too many colors over each other because that will cause the paint to start to chip and crack over time. So it's best to keep it as minimal as possible and just put one layer of paint, two or three tops. For the zipper, I'm just putting basic details that give the viewer an idea of what they're looking at. Their imagination will finish the job for me, so I don't need to make it picture perfect. And now I'm bringing it all together with a coat of black. For stars, I take my white cake, make sure it's really saturated with water, and I just flick my brush and make these little splatters on her chest. When it comes to painting drapery and understanding drapery, you really have to practice a lot and study a lot. I pay attention to where the joints are, so the inner elbows, the knees, crotch area, and the drapes come from those points. So the way the angles fall, you have to think about that and understand how that works. You just have to make it believable enough. To complete the look, I'm using a motorcycle helmet that I painted white, and it's the most affordable way to get a realistic looking astro helmet without actually spending a lot of money getting a real astronaut helmet. My favorite part about body painting is watching the concepts come to life. It occurred to me one day that there was something very interesting about outer space and the universe, and I wanted to make a connection with an astronaut, and it was just one of those kind of epiphany moments where I can have the astronaut unzip her suit and reveal the universe, her own inner universe, which I thought was kind of an interesting concept, so made it happen. Yeah. 